Why am I trying to do a TikTok in the store? Oh, I look a mess. Hello. Good morning, you guys. Sorry, but the lighting is pretty bad. Good morning. Oh, I said, did I bring my coffee? I got it. Good morning. Happy Thursday. Here's to another weekly vlog. Welcome back. I am headed to go drop the girls uh, to my parents' house. They finally made it back home, so I am so happy um, that they are back home because they love one over there. My parents are dependable. They're like my safe haven. So whenever they're not, if they're traveling or out of town, I just feel so lost. And I'm like, oh my God, what do I do with the girls? And then it's summertime. So Akai kept the girls for us um, this past week. But I, that girl now, like she sleeps. She sleeps. And so I had to constantly fuss at her to get up Watch the girls. And when they're up, you need to be up. You can go down. And, you know, this teenage, teenage stuff, teenage stuff. So um, she was happy that my parents were back too. So I am loving my glasses, you guys. From uh, Free People. Mm -hmm. um, they are. I think I showed these in my last vlog. Matter of fact, this is my first day wearing them because I forgot them there. Yesterday, the guys came and did the installation in our attic. Um, so they were there from like 6:30 until maybe one o'clock um, blowing it. So last night we had, um, we didn't have church, we had play practice. We're doing a play again on Sunday, the one we did in May on Sunday, just like a back to school thing, because it's a youth play. So um, I'm not as nervous, as, I'm not as nervous this go around to do it. Um, I actually, I'm actually kind of excited. Uh, so we have play practice last night. We had a meeting last night, so today, um, it's, it's Thursday, I don't know what to say, but, but so I'm supposed to go have lunch with one of my girlfriends for lunch, and that's it, I think. And this weekend, we don't really have that much planned. Micah plans to um, do some house, some stuff around the house, like add soft events around the house, but the attic is a bit event. Uh, he did it to the front of the house last summer, and it was a huge difference in our air. And um, oh my God, the guy gave us a quote yesterday for. A new AC unit is gonna run us about five thousand dollars. What? I was like, uh, no, okay, all right, we're gonna see if we can make this work. So, I did see a difference last night, and I also found another issue. I have a Nest app, and on the Nest app, I had my air set to seventy-five and seventy-eight. What was I thinking? I don't know. When I maybe maybe that's what it was in my old house, but that's why the that's why the air always goes up to seventy-eight and seventy-five during the day because I had it set that way. So I deleted the whole schedule from my phone. No, yeah, I deleted it. I deleted all the, I deleted all of the set temperatures above 72. Um, so it's set to go like the highest throughout the day is 72, supposed to. So we'll see if that happens. Um, so I don't know, but I might as well drop the girls off and head to work and happy. All right, y'all, I am about to head to go meet one of my girlfriends for lunch. We're going to this new Mexican place Okay, so these glasses, I have a big head, okay? I have a big head, there's no, oh, speaking of big head, I wanna try some fedora hats that, see how I just switched conversations? I wanna try some fedora hats this, um, oh, that's her, hold on. Hey. Is it the old Ryan? Yeah. Yep. Okay. Pedro's or something like that. Yep, I just, Part. I just wanted to make sure because there's like a hundred new Mexican restaurants this month. So. <laughs> yeah. There are a lot to choose from, but I heard good things about this one, so we'll see how it is. I'm on um, what is this Lake Street? So I'm like not far. Oh. Okay, I'm I'm not in a hurry, so you're good. Okay, all right. All right, bye. All right. Okay, so um, yeah. So, anyways, what was I saying? Oh, glasses. Like they're too, like they're wide, like kinda. And I find that the other day, or yes, this is my birthday wearing them. Early I put them on my head, so maybe like they stretch too easily. So I have to like go in and push them so they can fit on my face the correct way. This is how they're supposed to look, okay? They were kinda just like hanging. So anyways, just 
if you order these glasses, I'll have a link down below. If you order these glasses, just know that, oh, speaking of, I need to put this on my LTK. I meant to put this on my LTK earlier. Um, if you guys follow me on LTK, that is where I post pretty much everything first. And then I'll like take the link to my stories or social media or whatever or um, stuff. But my LTK has like pretty much always, I post there almost every day. Outfits, perfumes, jewelry, uh, accessories, whatever I can think of that I'm like, oh, somebody may enjoy this because I like it. I'll post it there. That's like my, if you want to shop me, shop anything that I have that I do. If it's linkable, it'll be on my LTK or my Amazon storefront. But even on my, even my Amazon stuff, I'll post on my LTK before I go and put it on my storefront because sometimes I don't forget to do that. So LTK is where I link pretty much everything that's linkable and then Amazon is second. So uh, let me take a picture really quick of the glasses. So I can make the collage in Canva. It's a lot that goes on behind the scenes. Uh, Sometimes I can just like post it the way we just post, but not always. So I say that to say, look, I made this post, I made this collage earlier um, this morning and I was so excited about this. I had to like crop out the background. Wait, I need to be getting on Ryan Street. Why am I, I need to get over. Oh God, please don't be mad at me. Can I get over real quick? Ah, Jesus! Oh, no wreck, thank God. And I see y'all comments about being vlogging and eating and talking and driving at the same time. I'm careful, y'all. I usually am careful. Just I was about to take a wrong turn. Um, so anyways. Oh, what was I saying? Let me try to talk to y'all. This is what I do. I squirrel in conversations where I like change it up and then go back to it and change it up. I hope y'all can follow me. I hope because listen, when I be editing editing this sometimes, I'll be like, what? What? Girl, what? So I just hope y'all be following me because this is how I be in real life. Like y'all getting the real life, uh, real life of me. Um, I think I'm not gonna do the collage. I want to do two pictures. This I can Instagram collage two. And oh, yep, see. And then I find it. I find the collage, and then I just customize it. So I want to take this picture off, delete that image, and I don't want to take. I want to take all this off, like. Oh, this is so much. They have sell, 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 sell. I don't want that. So I'm gonna delete all of that, and then I wanna, I wanna insert my two pictures, and then. Uh, El Pedro, Pedro's, Pedro's Tacos and Tequila Bar. Um, I just, yeah, I think the queso was good. My enchiladas, eh, eh. I'm gonna go back. I only had a water, so I didn't have a drink. Uh, my girlfriend did have a drink. She didn't say it was good or not, so I guess it wasn't good. She didn't, she wasn't like, ooh, this tastes good. <sighs> um, I forgot what I was trying to tell y'all earlier because my camera just like overheated on me because it's so hot outside. It said that the internal temperature of my camera was too high. So it just cut off on me. So I don't know what we were talking about. I know it was something interesting because that was like into the conversation, but it was like five conversations going on at once. I just don't recall what it is. So if I remember it, no, I, it don't matter if I do remember it. I, I don't know, girl. Maybe it'll come up. Maybe it'll come back up later. I'm headed back to work. Um, I placed an order on Wednesday, y'all, of all kinds of stuff. So here's the thing is that AJ's, AJ leaves next week for his college. Um, he leaves for college next week. I think his move-in date is Sunday, next Sunday. His dad's taking him, his dad is moving him in. Um, I'm not gonna be there, I'm not going. It's actually my anniversary weekend, so Micah and I may go somewhere for a night or may just go out to eat, I really don't know. What we're gonna do for our anniversary, but that's my anniversary weekend, plus it's Mala, Mala's first day of school. So, um, I can't say, I was I was kinda sad, but this is one of the one of the pitfalls of having a blended family. Um, because, you know, of course, he has me, his mom, he has his, his real, his, his real dad, his dad, 
um, he has his father and his dad, uh, which is my ex-husband, and then he has his stepdad, which is my husband, and then he has his stepmom, which is, which I don't, I'm not sure that's, that, maybe it's his ex-wife now, I don't think that they're still together. His ex-wife, um, but she still played a major role in raising, in raising him, so she is still in the picture, and I like her. So, um, I just think that, it sucks because like I took him to orientation but I will not be there you know I figured I was gonna have my crying and like oh my god I can't believe this moving I didn't cry for graduation I thought I would cry for when he moved but I won't be there when it when it happens so I'll just think of it as if he's gone for an extended stay to his dad's house you know what I mean so um that weekend I'll be busy uh, about my anniversary and stuff, which I think I might just take off. So like, I won't record it. I think just to focus my attention on Micah, um, because that is our 12th girl, 11. Why am I trying to add another year? 11, 11 year anniversary. Cause last year was our 10 year when we went to Paris. It was the first time out of the country going to Paris. Um, but yeah. Okay. So I am not going to ramble. I don't think I have anything else to talk about. It was a reason why I started this conversation. Oh, <laughs> I was trying to tell you guys that I ordered all kinds of stuff on Amazon because AJ leaves for college and his last minute stuff. Alea is leaving for college, which is my oldest stepdaughter. She's going to TCU. She texted us and said that she didn't have anything for college. So I got her a laptop. I got her an iPad with a pen. I got her a mattress cover. I got her, I mean, a mattress pad. I got um pamper you know ham, ham, pampers not pampers hampers things that she needed around the dorm so i spent a lot of money and then um aj's girlfriend is going to college as well with him to lsu so i helped get some of her stuff as well just because i was already ordering stuff so listen we say i spent some money 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 but um Mike and I are not going anywhere for our anniversary. Like originally I wanted to go to Jamaica for the weekend, but he, he was running out of uh, PTO time off. So um, it would have been a Thursday through uh, Monday. So it would have been Thursday, Friday. Would have flew out Thursday evening, been there Friday, Saturday, Sunday, flew back Monday. And it was like 2000 like $2,500 to go to Jamaica for a weekend basically. And I was just like, that's high. You know, like I would rather pay it for like a week you know at a time so anyways i said we wasn't going to spend that money so we saved that said we was going to just like save up for our, um our procedures and our surgeries and stuff this year so we won't be doing anything How, however i spent half i spent uh, more than enough money on um getting the kids ready for college so yeah i want to let you go because i've been rambling i've been sitting talking talking to y'all like i'm literally on facetime with my mom i'll talk to her like the whole way back to work and we talk about everything but stuff she talks back and y'all not talking back to me unless you leave comments down here i chat with y'all later but all right i'm gonna stop rambling and go back to work girl it's almost two o'clock thank you jesus my day is almost over with and i cannot wait alaya's coming over tonight i'm still talking okay bye y'all bye girl i just remembered this is what we were talking about i said oh okay i told you i was trying to do the um the link so i made this little collage in canva real quick for my stories of uh, the two things or whatever and like I'm gonna link free people's sunglasses and then I'm gonna add this picture and then the link to it on my story so if people were interested in buying them they're like oh I like her glasses bam they go through my link they buy it I get a small commission little bitty cock commission but the little bit adds up so um yeah that's what I came back to tell y'all because I was like I was talking something very important I was trying to show y'all behind the scenes of like posting and stuff um, and how I take my pictures and all that stuff, but my camera about to overheat again because it's so hot. So bye. Happy um, Friday, you all. Um, I took Alex. Where's my glasses at? Here it is. I took Alex to the um, eye doctor this morning. So sorry. I don't know why I don't have as much energy. I don't know. I did sleep, uh, we stayed up late last night watching um, a movie off of Netflix called Fatal. Oh, something's in my eye. Fatal or Fatale? I don't know how to pronounce it. It's sad. I know how to use it. I know how to spell. Oh, where are you going? I know how to spell and I know how to, I know how to pronounce. Well, no, I don't know how to pronounce. What am I saying? 
Fatal, F-A-T-A-L-E. Fatal? The E is what throw me off. Fatale? Maybe the E silent. Fatal. Um, the movie was good. It was about a guy, a married man who cheated on his wife um, one weekend in Vegas and he lied and said he was, his name was Darren and his name was really Derek and make a long story short I don't want to be a spoiler but it was like a she felt played because she found out they they both they both actually live in LA but they went to Seattle for the weekend mm -mm. they went to Vegas for the weekend the guy cheated on his wife in Vegas for a bachelorette weekend that weekend the girl however um is actually a detective in LA there was attempted there was an attempted murder or break-in in the house and she was the person who was assigned to the case so that's where she ended up meeting him at and she found out that he was lying his name was really Derek and he lied to her and said Darren so anyway take a long story short she figures out that the wife was cheating on him with the best friend and he ended up was like mad and about it and so he ended up sleeping with her again but that night she mentioned about her him wanting them dead so the girl goes eh, make a long story short watch it it's on netflix and i want to give up to give away too many details and it'd be a spoiler spoiler alert so we stayed up way late watching that we didn't start till like nine o'clock and we we're gonna bed till like close to 11 30. so i ended up ordering weeks up last night because i didn't feel like cooking and we door dashed it and that ended up being 60 dollars for a 24 24 piece boneless wings and two fries after the after after the delivery fee and tip was sixty dollars, I was like, man. But you know, it was prices. I did not want to cook, and it was late, and I was still full. So I only ate like two wings because I was still full from lunch yesterday. Speaking of lunch, I'm going ahead to go meet. Um, oh, I forgot my. I meant to bring my pen and paper to take some notes. I'm going to meet one of my friends. I call her like my little sister. Um, for lunch, we're gonna eat Mexican again because she was like, Hey, you just had that yesterday. Are you down for it? I'm like, Girl, I can eat, breathe, and sleep Mexican food. So, we're going to my favorite place to go eat lunch. And then, um, Alea's coming tonight, supposed to come tonight this weekend. We really don't have, I think I said that yesterday, we don't, don't have a lot of plans. But, y'all, I'm wearing my new earrings that just saw I got in the last vlog. I had on my heart necklace, but I was like, Oh, it's too much going on. So, I felt like this the simple necklace is my everyday staples I never take off. Um, these will be good. Oh, I need to make an appointment. Speaking of, I just thought about I need to make an appointment to get my permanent jewelry removed. Um, I've got to get it removed for my procedure. And um, that's, I think that's it. That's all I want to come in and tell y'all. I am tired. I had coffee this morning, but it ain't really kicked in. And I took AJ to get his exam. And also to get him some glasses. Usually I went to this place because they can do them in like an hour. But she said the machine was broken and it has to take two weeks to come in. So I ordered them and they'll be shipped to my house and I have to ship them to Alex because he leaves next weekend. But yeah, girl, that's it. I remember really see a lot going on in this vlog. So I'm sorry if it seems boring. I'm like talking, but you're just getting to know me, girl. You're just getting to know me in my everyday life. Let me get over. Oh, one of my coworkers used the um, Tonico. I have it in my car. The Tonico shop, not shop, girl, what am I? The Tonico mop and vacuum that I have because she said she really want, she wants one, but she was like, I don't know if they're gonna be good. So I was like, girl, you can use mine, see if you like it for a night. And she was like, oh yeah, I gotta have it, I gotta have it. The more I use it, the more I love it. The only thing I said about it was that like, it doesn't like, it's not a deep clean for your floor. So you still have to like heavy duty mop maybe once a month, but like for spot cleaning with the girls, I absolutely love it. I love it, love it, love it. But yeah, I'm gonna go eat lunch and I'll talk to you guys later. How you doing, man? How you doing okay so far? So yeah. <laughs> How are you guys? I'm off of work and of course I'm tired. I have to stop to Target to go and get some body wash from Mala Malia and my close friend, the girl who went to lunch with yesterday, she commented on one of my stories and said, hey, Target has the vanilla Nespresso pods. What? 
So y'all know where I'm at, Tarjay. Um, because I use the vanilla syrup in all of my coffees because I love the way it tastes. So I wanna go inside here. Hoping all people inside here, because I wanna vlog, but I'm gonna see how this goes. They have all this fall stuff out here. I'm gonna try to set y'all here. So it's not. Oh, my head too big. That's a cute fedora hat though. Really cute. Look how all they're falling for. I cannot wait to start doing false stuff. I'm in here for body wash. I'm getting fat track. Excuse me. Everybody's school shopping in here. I'm gonna fit all of my stuff already. Um, oh, the coffee. Right here. Yay. Perfect go. So, let me see. What coffee? Oh, here it goes right here. I'm gonna get this one. And this is a full cup, because I know, because it has mug here, so I'm gonna get that. It's $11. This is my favorite one here. I'm gonna get another one of these. Oh no, I just bought this. I just bought this. Never mind. I have that at home already. So, I think that's it for here. I want to see if they have a different brand of coffee. Because I'm, I'm open to trying any of them if it's good. Look at how I look I'm in this store. I was looking to see about any of these. I used to drink these a lot. But I don't anymore since I have my Nespresso. The, the Nespresso is just so much more smoother. Like it doesn't taste the same. It's like coffee. Let me set y'all right here so I can go get the other stuff. Smooth and sweet notes is what I like. And then this one, hmm. let me stick to what I know. Yeah. One of these. I wish I had so good molecules. Do they sell good molecules? At Target, I think only Alta has it. Kill two birds with one stone. Oh, no, I got, I got excited for a second. Sorry. But they don't have it. Okay. What? Body wash. Mm. Yeah. I don't want to try this brand, Ethereum. But I don't know if I'm gonna like it or not. If they have it out here up to the outside. Let's see. This lotion. Pre-poo. Ultra shield pre-poo skis hang on and protect. That's not on clearance stuff. Okay. Girl, I love somebody with these coupons. I love this body wash. Three dollars off of two. So was it nine plus nine is 18? <laughs> yeah, nine plus nine is 18 minus three, 15. That's $15 for two of them. That's pretty good. I might do that. I always get the purple one. I love the purple one. Retinoid. I might, oh, I don't think I've ever got the vitamin C one. Now that I think about it. Mm, it smells really good. Let me get both of these. I just got a coupon. Got a coupon, it makes it okay, right? The girls just use pretty much anything, so I'm gonna find them something. And they go through body wash like they go through water, so I'm not gonna 
get anything expensive. What am I gonna get? I wish I used bar soap. Uh, hmm. This is, nope. They do better with a pump. If they pour it out, they pour the whole thing out. They had all of this to figure out the right body wash. It's crazy. Swab. Ocean Breeze Swab. So I can't be mad if they, if they use it all. Is this soap? Nope, it's body wash. They're gonna get this. What is this, $5.99? Yes, sir. Oh, Ivory has. Aubrey has a mild and gentle body wash. This one's $6.29. Oh, this smells better. Mm. Mm. I'm gonna get both of them. So the girls will use that and then I'll use the Olay. I wish they had salt hair in here, but they don't. I need some more um, makeup wipes. So, let's see. Which one I'm gonna get? I'm more of a $3.99. $3.99. $3.99 versus um girl they sell urban skin rx here too. Yes. I'm gonna get these two. Cause I literally just use these for my makeup. I like to wipe makeup off of my um hands if it gets on there. Oh, Micah's calling me. Where you at? Watch. Hello? Okay. Your whole oh, never mind. calling somebody that he's going to get his hair done. Girl, look at this. Girl, salt hair. Oh, I never. I want to try the girl. I'm gonna do a reel right now. <clears throat> yep. Me buying this shampoo, the curl one, because I haven't tried the curl one. Where my phone at? Um, I'm gonna do the reel. Oh, they got all the different ones. The Moisture, Moisture Bound, which is, this is the one that I already have done a review on. Well, I haven't posted it yet. What is this? Damage Repair is the blue one. Damage Repair. And then, what's this one? Blonde. Purple is blonde, makes sense. Curl. Curl one. Curl. I'm gonna get the curl one. Cause I wanna try this. I'm going I don't watch my day. Yeah. So let's go ahead and get me a video of me buying this. Actually, I'm thinking of content right now because somebody made a comment on my TikTok. You shut up in front. My body wash when it said I want to see how the how the um, shampoo performs. So I want to do a video off of that one. So let me go find that comment. Okay. Find my video. Oof! I look a mess. I can't show my face like this. Oh, not me trying to do a TikTok in the store. Oh, I look a mess. I didn't comb my hair. Well, I did. I just put my hair up. Let me hurry up. Girl, me too. Look what I didn't found. And then I'm going to say curl control. Dang it! I forgot to set it to 60 seconds. Actually, I'm gonna do three minutes. Retake. Girl, me too. Look what I done found. Let's try these. Okay, now I'm gonna save this. Girl, me too. Look what I done found. See? Let's try these. Girl, me too. And then I'm gonna save it in my dress. All right. Urban Skin RX. This. I want this. I think that's it. Cause I needed this. I had stuff. I had this stuff in my Ulta cart. And all that. All that I need to get left is the good molecules. And I'm gonna get that at 
um, Alta. I'm gonna actually order it online. So, okay, I'm going out here for real. Let's go. Nothing else. Don't even look angry. Did I Curology yet? Oh, my friend did tell me that they had Curology. Oh. No. I heard, did I tell y'all that Garnier Fruities, I saw somebody do a video saying that they had micellar water, micellar water gel. I really wanna try it, but I haven't found it in the store yet. This one is micellar gentle peeling water. I don't need nothing peeling, bro. Okay, let me go, let me go, let me go, let me go. I'm trying to see if they have new stuff from Elf to try. Which I don't see anything that's new that I need to have, so let me get out of here. <sighs> okay, I'll talk to you guys later. Oh, yeah. Hey guys, um, it Thank is 9.57, almost 10 o'clock, 10 p.m. on a Friday night. Um, I was going to do a haul and showed you guys what I got from Target, but I think I showed you guys as I was buying it. So, um, I'm just finished editing my day in life and I have to adjust I'm gonna keep my original audio on there so like whenever you hear it like listen nice to know that my relationship with God is firm when it comes down to my faith walk because I've seen him do you things see that how I know you can hear the mute the water in the background the me popping my retainer in my mouth I'm trying to put a little ASMR with the voiceover and see how that does stop I'm tired I'm so tired but I want to show you guys what I had got from uh whoo no, Target. Well, I showed y'all in Target. And I also did the TikTok. Well, I started the TikTok. Um, that curl shampoo and conditioner. I like that one better than the Santal Bloom one. The moisture one. Um, the soft hair ones. I tried both of them. I did a review. I, I like both of them though. But to me, I find it to be more equivalent to like... I think it's, don't think it's better than Aussie, um, but Aussie, Aussie is cheap, but it gets the job done. Saltaire is affordable, but I don't feel like it's, it's not cheap. I don't know how to, I don't know how to explain it. I feel like I've used a lot of hair products and I just feel like there are some that feel expensive, um, I still like hands down think that Ajua deep condition is the is the best deep conditioner that I use that I like a lot. Every time I use it, I'm still wild, and I've gotten about eight or nine uses out of that Ajua uh, beauty. I'll tag it in the video if I can, if I can remember, if editing Adrian can remember to tag it down below. That deep conditioner is expensive, but I love it. I think it's worth every penny. But then there's also like some high end deep conditioners like. The Briogeo is pretty expensive up there, but I remember the first time I used it. This was years ago. This was years ago, so I don't know how it is now. You know, from from all this change, but I wasn't shocked or impressed the first time I used it to make me want to buy it again. And that's an expensive, that's like in a Sephora brand uh, deep conditioner. <clears throat> so I say all that to say that the Saltair is affordable, but it didn't feel luxurious. But I did like it a lot. Like I can see myself keeping that in my shower. And reusing it like for weeks at a time until I run out. That's how good it is. Um, so yeah, <clears throat> tomorrow. Can you please stop? What are you doing? I try to get up here. No, 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 no. My bed is not a climbing mat. No, ma'am. My bed is not a climbing mat. It's 10 o'clock. You need to go. I'm trying to get these kids starting to go to bed early because school starts next Friday. Malia don't start, I think, till the 20th because she's still in daycare, but Mala's school don't start, starts next Friday. So we're going to get them back in a routine, which I think I'm going to start hammering down Monday, 8.30. bed by 8.30. Let's see how that works because then I'm going to go to bed at night. But, yeah, I have not started editing this vlog, so I hope I can have it done for Sunday. Here's my thing, or how I feel. When I do these hour-long vlogs, I find that... Like I do, I uploads are a Sunday and Thursday. I feel like people may not have time to watch this vlog, watch the one hour vlog, and then I turn around and upload another 45 minute vlog. And it may be overwhelming for some people to be like, I can't keep up with her because it's total, my vlogs are too long. Am I making sense or no? 
because that's how I feel sometimes with some of these creators that I watch. I'm like, I really like their uh, content, but I'm like, I don't have three hours of my day to just watch, you know, the, the video. So <clears throat> my thing is, I gotta try to find it, incorporate. I'll talk to y'all like y'all literally my best friends because I'm really be trying to get advice from y'all. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm trying to figure out if I should like do a short video on Thursdays and like a long video on Sundays. Because Sundays people have more time on their hands. Like for me, Sunday afternoons is the best time for me to watch anything because I don't really have a lot to do. On Thursdays and Fridays, I'm busy. I want to have time. You know, that's just me. That's my schedule. Comment down below and tell me if y'all agree with me. Like, it's better for longer videos to be on Sunday. And like, try on hauls or like, skin care routines or like, hair reviews. All that to be on Thursdays. Oh, y'all don't care. Y'all probably don't care. Never mind. I'm just... <clears throat> talking i'm about to go to bed because i'm really tired i'm really tired so i will talk to you guys tomorrow oh look at that i can't even put, on, put never mind girl bye good morning guys happy saturday we're sending our our oldest off to college today so last time i'm seeing that she's leaving i think this weekend so Alea's leaving. She's going to TCU and McKK is going to Mississippi State. <laughs> no! And then he's going to LSU. I think she leaves first. You yes. leave on the 11th. Mm -hmm. Yours is what the 15th? I leave the 13th. The 13th and then the 16th. I leave the 13th. So they're going to be all fresh meat. Fresh meat going off to college. So. ready? You being weird. You being weird. You being weird. Oh, because give me a hug. I love you. Love you and you know I'm here if anything you need. Whatever. Good luck. Thank you for having me. You're welcome. You're welcome. What's up, y'all? Trying to light on so y'all can see me. So you can see me. I can see you. We can see each other. Um, it is five minutes to three. So almost three o'clock. Um. Alea, we sent her off this morning. I ordered her some last minute stuff. It's going to be shipped to her mom's house in Houston. And I think she leaves, like I said, on next week. Um, and then after they left, we ended up going eat at Cracker Barrel. No. no. We went to Cracker Barrel. But Cracker Barrel had a 45 minute wait. And we could not wait 45 minutes because we had play practice at 12. So we would have, what did we go eat at, Mala? Uh, wait, I forgot. Waffle House. Waffle House. We had Waffle House and it was okay. I need to fix my nail. This is the first time. Actually, it didn't pop off. It did not pop off. I was picking up something and I did like that and it bent. So the tip of it broke off and I ended up just like peeling the... I need to get a bigger memory card because this one, for whatever reason, I need to... That's something I need to do right now. I'm going to go on Amazon or Best Buy and order me another one. I was saying I need to fix my nails. This is the first time that it popped off with that solid. It did not pop off. My nails itself broke. Um, it bent and broke. So I just peeled the top off. So I'm going to do that in a minute. Fix that. Fix this nail. Y'all. This perfume. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm going to try to. I may post it today. I may post it today. So when y'all see this vlog, y'all can know I'm talking about if you watch my shorts. Or if you follow me on Instagram or TikTok or, TikTok or Facebook. This perfume smells so good. I gave the white one to Micah. I did a review on both of these because the girl on Instagram said that the pink and the white one smelled like so, so good. So I was like, mm, I don't know. This is my first day wearing it, y'all. And I got compliments already on this perfume. This stuff is amazing. Now, I don't think the lasting power is as long. Because I, I smell myself like the first three to four hours of me spraying it on me. When I got home, I didn't smell it as much. But I just sprayed some more on me because it smells so good. And now, like, I can't. This is all I'm smelling. It's just, ooh, it smells so good. The notes in this one was quite, um, I didn't think that I would like the notes in this one. They're sweeter. Let me see, because I put it on my storefront, on my Amazon storefront. And I have a link down below for this one. Um, and actually, on this link, there is an option for you to buy both of them here. Oh, is it going to, is it going to, there's an option to buy both of them. On the, the link that I put, you could 
get both of them here for like $52. It's cheaper that way. But this one perfume is $27. <gasps> they only have one left in stock. Ooh. Girl, whoever get it, get it. Or unless y'all buy... Oh, there's different ones. There's a black one. There's a yellow one. I got the white. <gasps> Girl. Nah, the white one I wasn't a huge fan of. <clears throat> it did smell good. It smells good. But this one is more sweeter. And that's why this was a woman's perfume. That one is unisex. And I gave that to Micah because I wasn't like wowed by it. But yeah, Yara is the name of this one. And it's by Lath Latapa. Latapa Perfumes. And this brand has a lot. If you click on their name, they have a lot. I want to try this one next. This one's supposed to be smelling like the um, Angel, Angel, um, Angel something. It's supposed to be like a spicy, but it's a unisex scent. So I may get that one too, but I don't need no more perfumes, honestly, y'all. I don't need I don't need any more perfumes, but I don't know. So I was telling y'all about the in my last vlog that I wanted to get some some, some fedora hats. So I ordered three from a content creator here who I follow, um, Fearless, Fearless, the Fearless, Fearless Collection, I think. Um, I started following her on youtube some years ago and then i kind of forgot about her and then i started seeing her on instagram and but she kind of came out with a jewelry collection and with the jewelry collection she came out with a fedora collection and her fedoras what sold me on buying it to me i felt like they were on the pricier side but i was like i'm supporting a small business a black woman a creator um so i i, I bit the bullet and i should have just brought one because after i did i was like oh god there's no returns or exchanges you know, so that's like one of the bad things about, bad things about I'm not gonna say bad things, one of the things that comes along with small businesses that don't have like the Amazon return policy. So I hope I like them. But anyway, I say all that to say that I brought her fedora hats because she has them in the extra large. I think I told y'all before, I have a big head. My head is big. I would love to be able to wear the baseball caps and be cute. I, would, I love the look of it, but my head is big. And the fact that she's natural and she says she has a big head and she could fit those, she could fit those fedora hats. So I ordered three of them and an extra large. They were seventy dollars a piece. I know, uh, expensive. I thought that was very expensive for a fedora hat, but I ordered them. So I'll give you guys my honest thoughts on that when they come in. Um, I would not be biased because because she is a creator. She doesn't know me. <laughs> you know, I don't really know her personally. I just watch her content. Um, but I'm interested to see how. How it is. Is that better? Your breath didn't stink before. You're so pretty. You're a beautiful girl. Mm. Alright, you guys, I'm gonna take our hair out, fix this nail, and call it a wrap it up. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to give me a huge thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel on your way out. Tonight Mommy. I think we're supposed to be going on a date night tonight. We yeah, have play practice. So I'll tell y'all what we did today. Why for how I, why, how was I ending the video and now I'm still talking? <sighs> Yeah, I'm gonna let y'all go because if not, this is gonna be another hour long video. And I said I wasn't didn't want to do that again. So yeah, okay. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.